and namaste from Dhananjay Kumar and thank you again for joining this series, a long series of videos, Great Minds, Great Quotes. And the topic for this episode is very interesting, money. And the first quotation is by Marsha Sinata, Marsha Sinata. Do what you love and money will follow. So the message here is that do what you love and when you love what you do, you become good at it. That's more important than trying to do something only to make money. Making money should be a result of what you do not the goal of what you do. That is the key lesson. Do what you love and the money will follow. Neil Simon Money brings some happiness. Money brings some happiness but after a certain point it just brings more money. How boring. So first part is money brings happiness. Okay, you need money to fulfill your needs, help others, hopefully. So it brings happiness. It meets your requirements, sustenance, survival, makes you happy. But after a certain point, which means when you had have had enough of it, after that, even with trying less, making less effort, because you, you have accumulated so much money, wealth, assets, that even a small return uh, on a fixed deposit, savings account, you earn enough interest and of course your capital is intact, you earn interest and then you earn interest on interest. So money keeps growing without working, without making any effort from your side. Money keeps growing after a certain point. Early on, you make much stronger effort. You spend a lot of time, energy, mind, attention, trying to make money to survive. But after earning much, much more than you need to survive and be happy, after that, it becomes quite boring that your money keeps coming without you trying to make more money, it just money keeps accumulating because you had started out from a base which was very high worth, net worth. So this is the kind of a humorous uh, comment on uh, our economy and society. Money brings some happiness but after a certain point, it just brings more money and more money is not always equal to more happiness. This quotation, some people think they are worth a lot of money because they have it. Just imagine someone who inherited a lot of money. His parents and ancestors made a lot of money, accumulated a lot of wealth and you inherited it without trying, without earning it. And you think you are worth a lot of money. It's an earn, unearned money. Money you have not worked for. But you think because you have money that you are worth a lot of money. So your worth is somehow related to the effort you are making, you have made. Effort you are making or made to earn money. Some people think that they have a lot of money and they are worth a lot of money. Now, some people may be worth a lot of money which they have earned on their own. But if you have inherited or just had a windfall gain from some somewhere and now you think that you are worth a lot of money, that is a false pride. Think about it. This one is by Coco Chanel. There are people who have money. 
there are people who have money and people who are rich. So I think the distinction between uh, having money, having a lot of money and who are rich. Now richness is not limited to money. You are rich in your uh, sentiments, you are rich in your ideas, you are rich in the contribution you have made to society, you are rich in your attitude, behavior, treatment of others. There is many kinds of richness. So by simply having more money in this particular sense is not necessarily rich. Richness is something broader than money according to this particular quotation. There are some people, there are people who have money and people who are rich. Thank you for listening and watching and we'll meet again soon. Namaste.